Congressman Mike Rogers visits an elementary school in Calhoun County that beats schools across the nation in a Read Across America challenge. Kyrie Word, second grade class at Coldwater Elementary School, won the reading contest competition. The class used the reading app Epic. The challenge was to see if elementary schools in the United States could read one million books. They set their goal at 500, and of course we way past that. As soon as we saw our name in the top 10, they would not put the app down. They were wanting to take it, take their iPads to lunch and take them home, and any spare minute of the day they were spent on that app. On Monday at lunchtime, we were number seven, but by three o'clock we were number one through the whole week until Friday. We were competing with South Dakota back and forth. They would be 100 books ahead, and then we would be 100 books ahead. And so we actually found out that their time zone gives them an extra hour at school after we're gone. So some of my friends that have the app at home decided that they were going to take it home for homework and continue the reading. Congressman Rogers stopped by Coldwater Elementary School to congratulate the class and present the House Mouse Senate Mouse book to the students. The book I gave them you know, talked about how, and it's for, for children their age, to kind of uh, conceptually get their heads around how a bill becomes a law. These kids did have done something really special with their reading project uh, to win a national award. I thought uh, was uh, something that warranted a special visit and come out and, and, and pat them on the back and urge them to continue to be that diligent in their, in their academic studies. Ms. Word's class read 3,154 books in one week.